hello everyone how to solve this problem for the values of m if we have 2 to the power of m minus 3 is equals to 3 minus m and we solve this problem for the values of m so here the very first thing we are going to do is here first we need to take the uh, minus sign common from the exponent of this term so that when we take negative sign from here it will be written as 2 to the power of minus times of 3 minus m is equals to this is our 3 minus m and now you see here both of these terms will become here same so that now here we need to take some substitutions here uh, so we take this exponent is equals to x uh, in order to write this equation into the simplified form okay so we take here x is equals to 3 minus m and now uh, we move backward and we put this value of x into the uh, above equation so after substituting this value we will get here this is 2 to the power of minus x is equals to uh, in the right hand side we will get here only x and now uh, here further we move uh, this uh, 2 to the power of minus x to the right hand side uh, so for this we need to divide both of the sides by 2 to the power of minus x so when we divide both of the sides by 2 to the power of minus x it will be written as in this form okay so now you see here in the left hand side we have these two terms are cancelled out by each other and we get here only 1 is equals to in the right hand side we get here x divided by 2 to the power of minus x and now here further we move uh, the term uh, we move the denominator term to the upsides and it will be written as x times of you see here the exponent of this term is negative when we move in the upside it will becomes here positive so this 2 to the power of minus x will becomes here 2 to the power of plus x and uh, now uh, here uh, we solve this problem with the help of lambert w function now here we little bit uh, explain about the lambert w function it is stated as w of a into e to the power of a is equals to uh, a only okay so here we apply this lambda w function on this type of uh, functions uh, so you see here if we have uh, an exponential function with base e and its exponent is multiplied by here then we apply this w function and its output is the exponent of e so the exponent of e becomes a so uh, the output of this whole function will be equals to a so now uh, here in order to apply the lambert w function on here first we need to make the terms in the right hand side in this form uh, because uh, it means that we first make the exponential term uh, with the base e and its exponent is multiplied by here so uh, we focus in this uh, 2 to the power of x and we know that 2 to the power of x is written as when we apply a log and anti log at the same time on this term it will be written as e to the power of uh, log of 2 to the power of x and here we use uh, the property of log and according to this property we move this x in the front of this log and it will becomes e to the power of x times of log 2 so you see here over uh, this term 2 to the power of x is uh, written as e to the power of x times of log 2 so now we replace this value on here so after replacing this value over above equation is written as in the left hand side we have this is 1 is equals to in the right hand side we have x times of 2 to the power of x and 2 to the power of x is equals to e to the power of x times of log 2 so now you see here in the right hand side we have uh, the exponent of e is x times of log 2 so uh, according to this function it is multiplied by here but here we have only x and we need here log 2 so in order to uh, make log 2 from here we multiplying on both of the sides by log 2 
so when you multiply both of the sides by log 2 it will be written as log of 2 is equals to x times of log 2 is multiplied by e to the power of x times of log 2 and now here we are ready to apply the lambda w function on both of the sides uh, so that we apply this w on both of the sides and after applying this w it will be written as uh, w of x times of log 2 is multiplied by e to the power of x times of log 2 and now you see here uh, the output of the right hand side according to the uh, above w function above lambda w function is written as the exponent of e so the exponent of e is x times of log 2 so the output of this whole function is equals to x times of log 2 and uh, now here further uh, we uh, because we find uh, or we solve this problem for the values of x uh, so uh, we need to divide both of the sides by log 2 so when you divide both of the sides by log 2 it will be written as in this form so uh, this uh, equation is implies that this log 2 is cancelled out by this log 2 and we will get here uh, our x is equals to uh, w of log 2 divided by log of 2 so here uh, we move backward and we substitute uh, the value of x here because in the start of the problem we will take care of our x is equals to 3 minus m so uh, we put uh, this value of x here and after substituting this value it will be written as 3 minus m is equals to uh, lambda w of log 2 is divided by log of 2. So after that uh, here uh, we need to move the whole term from right hand side to the left hand side and we move this minus m to the right hand side. So it will be written as 3 minus Lambert W function of log 2 is divided by log 2 is equals to m only. So uh, this is the, our final value of m here. Uh, we write the approximate value of this term is equals to 2.358 and 8192555. So this is the approximate value of the above function uh, so here you can easily get this value from any online calculator or any uh, wall from alpha function okay this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos